Hey guys, I realized I could have done a little bit more with that last video, so I thought I'd show you the double gate version of the piston mod gate. Here you come up, and boom. You got all three coming down, making the full gate there. Um, I've got the pressure plate lined up with the switch still, so you can uh, come up, whack that, and everything holds in place as normal. And then you can let that go. Um, I also thought I'd show you the wiring today, too. It's just... Um, you got the pressure plate here that leads to a couple of redstone to the uh, lever. Comes down. Um, this one, this one right here leads to the center one on the block. Um, these two that come back here lead to the side ones, and that activates all three of those. Now, when coming up here, I've got that set down a block below, and this one comes up here. Step, step. Um, this one leads to the center, like on the bottom. You do need a repeater block or some form of extender that leads it, uh, that'll allow it to get all the way over here first. And it's just the, base, the same basic structure for both of them. Um, I would also like to note that there is an odd glitch in it where if you're trying to do the double gate and you have it set for the lever, it will drop down the, uh, the uh, first one here if you're using the single gate. And yeah, that uh, just a fun little bug. Now I'll show you the full completed hallway version of the triple gate there. All right, now here's a completed uh, hallway version of it. I got this set up out there, redstone up here. And as you walk through, there's the gate. Hit the switch. Boom. Nothing. Nada. Can't get through. And we'll come around back here. Let's say if you're running, you're running, you're running, you hit that switch friggin' creeper right here. Can't get to you. You got two blocks of space right there, and he's got nothing. So yeah, just thought I'd show you the full gate version of that. Thanks for watching.